Is your depression caused by the person in your bed or your town? Have you ever come across a statement, whether written or heard, that stays with you for years and years, maybe even forever? Do you suffer from depression or just a generalized sadness? Do you sometimes have a feeling of being overwhelmed or trapped without a seemingly logical cause? Are you depressed? Do you think there's something wrong with you? Now this might be one of those aha statements for you. Before you diagnose yourself with depression, look at the jerk lying next to you. Depression may be related to more than just your brain. Depression can be caused by many factors, not just hormonal or a brain imbalance. Depression can be caused by a situation or an environment. How is your relationship? Do you feel loved, appreciated, or valued? Or do you feel like your opinion doesn't matter, that you're not respected, and you feel that you are not heard most of the time? Do you sometimes feel that it doesn't matter to your loved ones if you are even around? The greatest cruelty is our casual blindness to the despair of others. Not being cared for is damaging. You may have always been the strong one and took care of everything, but that doesn't mean that you deserve to have all the weight on your shoulders. If you're struggling in your relationship, there are solutions. This doesn't mean that the relationship is bad and you should leave him or her. It can simply mean that tweaking how you view something, and more importantly, how you view yourself, can make all the difference in the relationship. Hypnosis can be powerful when it is used for love, relationships, love of self, and self-esteem. Many people report that long-standing issues resolved and quickly faded away after some hypnosis sessions. Sometimes letting go of what doesn't serve you is the easiest change you can make when you have hypnosis on your side. People become stuck in ruts with the same behaviors repeating. Shaking up those behaviors in a positive manner may be all that is needed to move forward with a new way of interacting. Environment is a very powerful influence. There is another factor when considering depression. Your environment. Gallup Healthways has an index that measures well-being of residents throughout the United States. In particular, some areas rank high in well-being. Well-being is marked by highest reported rates of healthy eating, lowest rates of daily stress, lowest lifetime diagnoses of depression. Which locations are the happiest? Several of the highest ranking communities boast temperate climates and locations near the ocean. Florida and two in, in California and one in Hawaii among the top 10 happiest places in America. Boulder, Colorado ranked high because they feel a strong sense of purpose in their jobs and pride in the community. Areas that have a high percentage of professionals tend to suffer more from productive stress. Where do you think your city falls on the well-being scale? No matter what your situation, you need to be aware of self-care. Whether you're struggling in a relationship, need help seeing brighter days, or are in a high productive stress area, I can help you align your mind with your desires.